Well, I can't remember what lake we're in, but I'll edit it um, after. I'll put the um, details in. Put some effort in! <laughs> oh. Oh. It's nice and uh, to show you the view and as you can tell from the goggles on my head I've been for a swim it's a lovely bay and up there is a, a flat area with um, really good camping but of course you have to get your gear up that site and that's just thousands of years of moss and compost and all sorts and it's not so bad we've taken a walk up there but getting all this gear two canoes worth up there is something else. We could obviously leave the canoes on the beach. But um I mean you can see perhaps how clear the water is. Handy's out fishing over there. So it's really nice. We just pull up being polite. The mud under here, I mean, I don't know if you can see my footprints there from before. It really is compact. I'm just being careful where I tread. Oh, look, a rock. Just because there, there are some soft bits, and I don't know if any of those soft bits could give into who knows what. But I've heard all sorts of stories, and, um, you know, there could be an old hole that's filled in with mud, and it could just take me in. So have to be careful but really I don't think there's anything to worry about you can see I'm still walk whoops there we go there's a soft pocket of mud right there so here we are again I'm actually walking out this time the water's quite cold and refreshing but hey when you live out in the wilderness of four or five days you need to have a bath and this is great. It's actually really, really, um, really refreshing. You know, I'm not shivering right now. Although we just paddled 2.7 kilometers in driving wind, really quite a strong headwind with um, water breaking over the bow. And, um, you know, that was hard work. So what better way to treat myself than to have a swim? It's crystal clear water again. At least it was until I started muddying it up. But what? None of that. <laughs> Keep the camera up. So it's just so nice. And it's clear all the way over there. The water is actually clearer where those rocks are. Um, because it's a fish.
no, just because it's rocky there and we're away from this um, stuff that's fallen in from this headland here. But, um, I've swam enough now, I've had a bath, time for coffee, maybe a snack and then um, I head out into the boat and have a fish. knows the sediments may settle and in a million years time my footprints would have made it I shall see you later